Hey guys, it's Gleason here and welcome to a new speed build video. So today we are continuing the base game plus build series and we have moved on to get together which is probably the expansion pack that I like the least but speaking of the world that was added in this exp expansion pack, it is probably one of my favorites because it is inspired by uh, Europe and it reminds me a lot of all those lovely villages that I see when I go to Germany, which is one of my favorite countries here in Europe and I don't know. I haven't traveled um, a lot outside of Europe, so... I'll stick to Europe for now, okay? Not in the entire world, but it's really a lovely um, area to visit. So if you have the chance, go to Germany, go see the um, Black Forest or the Romantic Street. They are amazing. But speaking of travels and going outside of Europe, right now, as you are listening to this voiceover, I am either on the plane to Los Angeles or already at my destination. I am super excited for this trip, but the bad news is that being the terrible, like terribly organized person that I am, uh, I ended up having to do a lot more things that I had um, expected. So I had planned to pre-record two videos for the Friday that I'm away and the Friday when I get back because I get back on the 17th so the 18th is a Friday I think and of course after a 12-hour flight it's not like you really have uh, <laughs> the time and and are awake enough at least I don't think I will be to create a video but I might I might so Worst case scenario, no video for the next Friday and the one after that. Best case scenario, no video for the next Friday, but I will have one when I get back. Especially because next uh, expansion pack is silly living, so I might be able to just make a quick apartment. I don't know, maybe I'll have some time. It's still uh, Wednesday, so maybe I'll have some, like extra time tonight or tomorrow to uh, start creating it so I just have to finish edit and record the voiceover when I get back I don't know I'll let you guys know I'll keep you updated I will try and share some photos of me and my friend Julia in Los Angeles if you guys would like to see that I'm going to the Universal Studios as I have already mentioned a couple times I guess uh, and I'm super excited because I am a Potterhead, my graduation thesis was on Harry Potter, so I am incredibly excited to go there, get the interactive wand, cut some spells, uh, see the, you know, um, replica of Hogwarts. I'm, I'm super excited. So, yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. But back to the build. Um, as you saw in the little machinima at the beginning, this house is... Um, in this house, there are two people living here, and they are an old couple, um, kind of inspired by the stereotypical German person. I don't know, I don't know. I kind of thought about that. I love Germany. It was meant in, like, no, no, no disrespect was, was meant, all right? It was done in the most uh, lovely and adorable way, because I love... Germans, I love Germany, I love German food, I love Germany itself. Guys, I'm I'm kinda German obsessed. <laughs> but yeah, so they are um Otto and Helga and they are this lovely, lovely couple who live in this um small home which is totally not my style because it's a lot more traditional, a lot more um Wooden tones, I usually go for more um, lighter color schemes. Like, if I use wood, it's, it's usually lighter wood. Or I use, um, I tend to build more contemporary or modern um, houses. I have 
started to work on some industrial, more industrial builds lately, as you saw here on my channel. But this is definitely not something that I would generally build. But I found a picture online with this beautiful house. There was only the exterior. And I thought, um, who could live here? What could the inside of the house look like? And when I was furnishing, I, I could totally picture an old nice couple living here so yeah that's that's what I did and I really had to go out of my comfort zone because I had to use a lot of um, pieces of furniture that I never ever use like um, those um, those couches and um, the lamps and the ceiling lights it was totally not my thing but I love the final result I think it looks super cozy super warm and a lovely place to to stay it's just the two of them so I didn't put any extra you know guests um, things like a bigger table because they don't really they don't really see their family a lot because their family moved to San Myshuno while they stayed in Winterberg so they don't really see their grandchildren a lot and it's usually them who go visit the grandchildren and their daughter so yeah it's it's not like they are gonna have a lot of people over and here in the hallway, I d in the entrance, I decided to, I don't know, recreate some of that grandma uh, clutter feeling, like the duck there. It looked a little bit tucky maybe, but also nice, something, something that you would see in your grandma's house. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but at my grandparents' place, both of my, uh, like, both my dad's parents and my mom's parents, I see a lot of weird stuff, a lot of um, kind of crazy different kinds of decorations and I think like, uh, I would never put these in my house but it kind of fits here. So I decided to go for something like that and uh, of course they are not big technology users so there is no computer no TV, they like just spending some time chatting with a tea uh, in front of the fireplace or staying outside because Helga is a great, great, great gardener. She takes amazing care of her plants. Uh, she loves to be able to cook with fresh ingredients while Otto is a um, is good at everything. Like he's one of those old style husbands that can literally who can literally fix anything like the tub is leaking fix it the um i don't know the roof needs to be fixed because some shingles are missing done and he is of course awesome with the woodworking station he loves creating these little pieces of decoration like um a horse sculpture or he um, he is currently trying to make some pieces of furniture so they can replace maybe some older ones and yeah they are an amazing couple I really really like them uh, I mean I have my grandparents but I wouldn't mind having grandparents like them I mean they look like um, a kind and fun couple they are super adorable so yeah here is the bedroom, which is upstairs. I know it's not ideal because older people might have some difficulties, you know, climbing up the stairs, going up and down all the time. But I thought they like spending time outside in the nature, uh, so they would only just go up there once or twice per day. So it's not really a big deal. I don't, I don't think it is. I think they like their home. And I also did a thing there that you can see here. Um, I wanted to have a more detailed um, ceiling, so I added some. How can you? How can you call them? Some some beams, some uh, wooden beams, I would say. And I thought they looked a lot nicer, you know, also in pictures. Because if you look up and you see just a plain 
white ceiling. It's kind of boring after a while, and I thought that they would have an open ceiling with some uh, wooden beams, and it it looked a lot better. But it gave me quite of a hard time placing the lights because I, of course, wanted it to be realistic and have the lights hanging directly from the the beam and not from the uh, empty ceiling. So yeah. But again, I want to remind you guys that this build is entirely base game plus get together only. There is no other pack, pack involved and I hope you guys will appreciate the effort because you know me, I love building with all the packs. I love having endless uh, possibilities because the great things with, um, with having all the packs is that you can create things that are a lot more realistic, you can add a lot more details, you can do a lot of things, but it's also a fun challenge to do something like this, something which is harder because you have to find a way to make things look good, to make uh, the house look like it has everything it needs and honestly, honestly, I cannot wait to move to the game packs and stuff packs because yeah I mean the expansion packs are good like especially city living and cats and dogs we have a lot of items but the real character of the house I think can be achieved only with the stuff packs because you have like completely different styles and you can get so so creative and I love that I really cannot wait it's gonna take me a while to do all the packs like all the uh, pack restricted builds but I hope you guys are enjoying it let me know in the comments down below if you want me to continue following the like release order or if I should uh, you know give priority to a specific pack that you guys own and that you would like to to see or download for your sims so leave some suggestions in the comments and I will love 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 to um, follow what you guys want like I, I this channel is for me but it's also for you so if I can make you happy that makes me happy so yeah here I was working on Helga's little um, fruit and vegetables garden and well and some flowers too under those uh, glass things that I scaled down and oh the woodworking table I placed it on um, like facing the wrong way and I couldn't understand why Otto couldn't use it and it was uh, frustrating until I realized that it was facing the wrong direction so I just um, moved a couple things uh, rotated it and and it worked so yeah uh, I hope you guys like this video I really cannot wait to be back from Los Angeles so I can go back to um, creating more videos I mean honestly I love the idea of being in Los Angeles I love the idea of not having to think and not having to worry about anything but of course um, I don't have a laptop well I do it's an old one it's terrible so it it doesn't work so I will absolutely miss playing The Sims and creating things for you guys so please 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 don't unsubscribe bear with me it's just it's just a couple weeks okay and I'll be back and I love you guys a lot and yeah that's it for this video I hope you liked it if you did please give it a big thumbs up leave a nice comment below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thanks again so much for watching I wish you all a great day and I'll talk to you next time bye
Thank you.